What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. I think we're up to episode. This be? I think it's like episode 4. No, 5. 5? We're, we're somewhere in the middle. But I think episode 5. And last time, we. Actually, gotta remember. What do we do? We. Oh, that's right. We managed to get a hold of a flamethrower. Um. It wasn't too much of, like, uh, anything scary last episode, from what I remember, which means that it's highly likely I'm going to get my pants scared off of me this episode. Um, but, thank you guys, if you're back and you've been enjoying this series, I would like to say at the beginning of my videos, usually I say this at the end of my videos, but I want to say this at the beginning, just so that you guys, um, remember to do it. Uh, hit the subscribe button. Because it's really helping me out a lot. The people who have subscribed, you guys are helping me out a ton. Uh, and leave a rating, all that sort of stuff. Uh, because it allows me to know, one, if you guys are enjoying this content, and if you want to see more, and all that sort of stuff. So, uh, it really helps me out if you do all that sort of stuff. Um, I also have a second channel that I'm going to be uploading videos to, that I just kind of want to plug, uh, in regards to more game development stuff. Um, so, if you guys are interested in either seeing the behind the scenes kind of developer logs of game development or you want to see uh, video tutorials and that sort of thing i'm going to be posting that over on my second channel uh, which is called the wizard tower um yeah the wizard tower so uh if you want to check out that sort of stuff jump over there hit the subscribe button all that sort of stuff to see when that stuff comes out too um there'll be a video very soon so uh definitely go over to that channel check it out if you're interested um but yeah so now we cover our bases, uh, what are we going to do in this episode? So yeah, as I said last time, we... Oh, we also got the shotgun. So we got the shotgun... I th Wait, did we? Yeah, we got the shotgun and we also got the flamethrower. So we got two major kind of weapon upgrades. And we also got a couple of health upgrades, I think as well. So we're kind of stacking ourselves up to be a little bit stronger. So I'm expecting there's going to be some kind of... Host hostiles or some kind of bad bad news in this episode so uh, let's let's just get into it and let's just run into danger shall we oh my god we got a bunch of stuff in here too I forgot about this uh, we've got strong chem fluid so that will hmm I've kind of been saving this but I, I kind of want to use this since we have it we won't use it here yet. Alright. Uh. Oh yeah, also check this out. I've got some cool lighting set up. As you can probably see, I've got my uh, Christmas lights up. Almost Christmas, but check this out. I'm trying to figure out a way that I can automate the change of this to kind of match the video. Uh, so I'm still working that out, but that'd be pretty cool. It gives it more immersion. Right now it's kind of orange. Let's change it to like an orange. Be a darker orange. This is literally just my second monitor. <laughs> I'm changing the color. Kind of match it. Kind of cool. That I'm 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 working on stuff to kind of see if I can make some some cool, more immersive content for you guys. Um, what are we doing? So we have to get, so we're going to have to get that, I'm assuming. The, the spider. Maybe that's what our goal. I feel really safe with this flamethrower, but I don't think I am. So we burnt the spiders in this room. Spiders in this room. Burn. How dare you sting me? Aha. Perfect. <laughs> we went through a lot of uh I kind of want to unlock as many places as possible first. Alright, 
Well, we've gone through a lot, a lot of ammo just now. Solar fuel and strong chem fluid. And what's this? A fluid. Completely restores health. Hmm. I might hold on to it then. We'll see. some pathways first. That way, if we, in case we need to like run, like we were doing with the dad, uh, we kind of have some clear paths. Uh-oh. Um. Yeah, I think we'll just make some, some regular fuel. So spider song. I mean, I'll take it. It's just some worms. What's in here? We got some more ammo. Well, we got some more ammo, so that works. As well. I'm turned around. Okay, so this is the way around. Exploring. this out here. Okay, so we got a couple of locations. Let's deal with this. Putting the rope? Oh my. I guess I'm 
cutting it. Can't use it here. Oh, okay. Maybe so. I must need to like find a crank. Yeah, but hooks in it. Okay. Okay, so we can't come here yet. That's fine. Who's over here? I think we found part of the, the flame over there. Maybe? Still storming. Alright, switch back to knife. I hear one of those things. me, but I don't trust you. Hi. Oh, hey. I need that. No more bullshit, Mia. I want some answers. I know. I know. You're right. And I always wanted to tell you, but but I just, I can only remember a little and the rest is just gone. <laughs> All right. Daddy, right? right? You mind if I uh, borrow mommy for a little bit? Why don't you stand there? Do something! Ethan, help! Wait, what? Damn it. Am I Danny? Wait, I'm confused. What just happened? Why? Wait, what? He called me? Did he call me daddy? That was she... Well, I mean, it makes sense that she might call me that. <laughs> uh... I'm very confused as to what position I play in this weird family. Well, I got them the puzzle thing. That doesn't happen. This oh a coin. To make sure. Am I gonna get jump scared now that I'm coming out here? Don't hurt me. That's a lie, but I'm gonna stick with it. It would have worked as a jump skip, but I was expecting it, so. You almost got me. Oh, I'll take that. What? Sorry. Oh, you told me to stay back. Are you not gonna be as passive or as uh, aggressive? You're gonna be a little bit more passive on that. Hey, that's right. What you gonna do? Oh, hell no. Heal. Okay, but I'm not that I'm not that scared. Because I know how to get there. Yeah, 
I know the layout of your house. What is here? Bada bing. Uh, ooh. Bada boom. I don't know why I've started saying bada bing. Bada boom. I started to say it. Oh, I cancelled it. Nope. Put it back. Getting I have a torch. Fuck, 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 fuck. Centipedes are poisonous. Don't let them bite you. Jesus, fuck. See, I'm pretty sure centipedes are poisonous, but millipedes aren't. I could be wrong on that. Don't take don't take my advice as medical advice. to be a box here. I don't remember if she destroyed it last time. Oh, hello, stairs. Bro. Ah, oh, that's right. And then we, we <coughs> dropped down here, and then she got caught. Like this. We die. I think we need to. I think she was trying to keep us away from that area until we can fix. Tink. Mid tink says the kids. Break that. I don't know how many of those we need. There's, a, there's like a number. Oh, hello. <coughs> and... <coughs> Can I use that crank here? Oh, that was handy. Can I, can I have that back? Yeah. Ooh. That makes my life a million times easier. Not really. Would have taken just as long. I saved myself like a couple of seconds. Flamethrower time. Four. And uh, let's craft some ammo. I mean, actually, let's let's get the, the hotter stuff. Which way? This way. As you can see, the centipedes, they look to be a projected fixture. It, maybe? Because they're very pixelated. Right? Especially on this wall. So I'm thinking this wall has like a, a texture layer that just has animated uh, centipedes. I'm not sure about above us. That looks really cool. 
the reason why I say it's um, a texture is if you look at their legs, their legs look like kind of the pixels appear and disappear. Cool, it's a cool effect. Uh, they've, they've optimized it so that you don't. So that your frames don't drop. Because uh, the other way that you might do this would be, say, like a particle system. Which is. Uh, it's gonna be hard to get something to crawl along the surface with a particle system, so it might just be easier uh, for them to have just done it via a texture. Yeah, because you can see, you can see some of the, the insects kind of crawl uh, and they appear underneath. So this is an animated, what you call a decal. So it's projecting a texture over the top of another texture as a decal. And they've just animated it, so it's like a, a, a 2D animation. Uh, but you can animate it with uh, normal maps and uh, that gives it kind of that 3D you might even be able to do a, a cool displacement thing. Because I can't rotate my camera too much, which might break the illusion. If I, was to, uh, like if I was to rotate my camera kind of from you guys that way uh, more, like if I want to rotate from this side to that side, it would probably break the illusion. So this is probably very heavily dependent upon. That's cool, it's cool to see that take, like, a, I think you just, you just saw that, that sort of thing cool into the wood, and then, like, it was just a flat texture. I would like to make a texture like that, just kind of play around with how that works. Maybe I will. I'm doing, like, a jungle uh, environment, so it would be, it would be insects. We got a safe place here. Oh wait, I'm trying to make ammo, but I don't have the solid fuel, do I? I know. Uh, okay. Well, I guess we don't do that then, and I just mix some elf. Let's do that, and I will grab. This, in the event that we need to, uh, in the event that we need to use it, uh, more ammo, because we might as well. Ammo. Okay. All right. We cool. We good. Yes, I can Can I not fight the swarm? That reset them. I go back to come. Okay. Here. to get a long way. Okay. Stuck my ammo though. I don't know if she can, like the mother is able to restore those things because I 100% burnt the, the nest. Now I'm kind of confused as to I'm supposed to fight them. Okay. 
Chief Hello. Do I have to sneak, sneak past? Like, what? I'm very confused. Maybe I do? Oh, we got the crow key. Okay, so we have to go upstairs. Excuse me, you're not coming this way, are you? Okay, so we gotta rush upstairs. Okay. Oh, what's my health on? We're still in the green, so we just gotta run. the door. Okay, hold on. M. We come in here, and then we gotta get upstairs. That was going downstairs. Uh, where was the upstairs? Now we can see. We just make a noise. Kids room. Um, it kind of looks like. Go out into so that's the gallery. The living room is where like the big bowl is. Uh, whatever. What is? Oh. Yeah, we just need to go from here to here. That's it. So nothing. Actually. And then we go across the bridge. Let's just close this as well. We don't need this to open. Do we? I think we do. Thank <laughs> you. 
Just like shoot her a bunch. I'd rather try and climb up. But then we gotta deal with the bugs, man. Gotta deal with the bugs. She scared the shit out of me. Thought she was safe, but then she does uh, freaking shadow coin jutsu. She's here, and then I go over here, and then she's teleports. That is called cheating. Reload this. You gonna teleport? I told Hello. You to stay out of here. Absorbed into the ground? Rusty shotgun, alright. Well, good to know. I wasted a little bit, but. Okay. Uh, let's. Where is it? the key? Let's. Make another one. Jeez. Quiet. Oh, this is the recipe. Uh, regarding the uh, series serum, the following items: the able synthesized serum. Okay. We fight ingredient. Uh, D series. Uh. Cranial nerve, B series, uh, peripheral nerve. Is that what I, I have to like it. get out of this? Okay. Yo, what's up, girl? Well, did he find a serum? I just got done dealing with your mom and her fucking bugs. Wish you could have warned me. <laughs> Sorry about that. What about the serum? I haven't found any. But I did find out we need to make one. A D-series head and an arm. This can't be right. A head? I think I have that around here somewhere. You do? <laughs> I don't know about the arm, though. Have you searched the whole house? No, not yet. 
I still need to check the second floor here. All right. Check it out. Meet me at the trailer if you find it. Oh, she can just get to the trailer? So, is she, like, playing... Uh... Hide and seek with her mum as well? Also, it said... What did it say? It said... Uh... Peripheral nerve. How the hell does he know that that comes from an arm? I don't know that. Is he like a doctor or something? What a cranial is the head. I mean, he could just be more educated than me. That's definitely, that's definitely likely. What was this guy prior? I want to know, know my character's backstory. I got a lot of questions. Oh. Uh, my ears have been ringing all day, and I haven't been and I haven't been able to sleep since the child showed up. Uh, it's like Zoe s says. Something strange about the child, and the woman she brought with her. Huh? I'm seeing things, hearing things, can't stop feeling nervous. I went to, uh, I went to see the doctor in town and he gave me an x-ray. What's happening to me? The child gave, uh, the child gave me a present. Present? Is child patient zero? Um, I put the present in the secret room right at the back of the second floor where nobody will find it. The arm. The arm is a sign of the child's trust. That arm will lead us to happiness. And anyone who corrupts that happiness, I won't allow them to live. The child gave you an arm. So like a doll arm? <laughs> I don't think it's a doll arm. I think it's a real arm, but... Okay, sure. Well, I'll take that. I want that. Why did it make that sound? Three and then I have five? Because I have two in the, the box. Okay. Uh, I need to get another lantern. I suppose. Did I not... Did I have to grab something from the mum down in the pit? There is that other room. Oh, you still alive? Hello? Oh, I still need this. Uh. Well, that's changed. Come on, don't be mad. I beat you with my shotgun. Ain't a big deal. You got you got a lantern, so I have to get the lantern from her. Okay. 
Okay. Come on, I need that lantern from you, please. Hello? Let me check the map. Very minute if it's there. to go into the trailer so that's enough uh we probably have to go back into the house though. i think what we heard was just telling us that not dead and she's moved to jump scare us somewhere else i think we've done everything here oh Go and get jump scared again. Because that was like a minor interaction. I can run. Like faster. Hey, Ma. I'm coming. Oh, we didn't unlock this. Oh, that's probably why it made that noise. Oh yeah, well, we might as well. So is this medicine to temporarily sharpen the senses, making items to, item detection easier? I don't know if I should go back to that building and use this. We do have to go back there anyway for that with the lantern. So I think once we get the lantern, we need to remember to use this as we walk through, just so we can kind of see. But we got a couple, so I might also use it. Uh, when we go back into the house, since we now have the other key. Um, I if we're gonna need this. Put that away as well. And we'll put that away. So we just need seven. Uh, I want to rearrange it. I don't really use the pistol straight up. I'm going to switch to my shotgun first. I'm going to set that to be my primary. Sorry, I set that to two. Nope. Okay, 
Okay, so there's a couple of places with the crow. Um, it was down there. Oh no, it was it was back this way. That way. Yeah. So let's save for real quick. Are you sure? I'll take that. A grenade launcher. Okay. Oh, I'm glad I came back here. I don't have enough room. So it's just that. And that's the extra hot stuff. But no, alright. Let's go back to the ground. We'll put this away as well because we can't craft it. Um, and then we'll use this. Okay. We got fuel pallets. Just put everything away. Got one bullet in this. I'm gonna. I think, I'm gonna put this away too until we need it. I don't think we're gonna need it yet. It's only got one bullet, which means it's like a a one-time use for now. found a lock there. There was a, a place we wanted to loot. Okay. So, I think it shows up on the map, if I'm not mistaken. Small key. Oh, that's probably the uh, right because uh, that's a 
that's that room that we're just in. I need a lockpick. Okay. Um. Mom's room, recreation room, but so we've unlocked all of that. There was the basement as well. This is the morgue. It looks like we unlocked everything. There was the um, at the workshop. Incinerator. Where the workshop was where we fought the head, right? I can't remember which room that was, but that one had a snake. Oh, so, can't get through there yet. So, I feel like we could probably complete this game without the need of the extra weapons, but going back to get them, it's kind of like a little bonus. Makes our life in the long run. Because there's nothing else in those rooms, so they feel very nice. Okay, let's use one of these. And I'm gonna use it out here. Seeing anything? Uh, oh, there's something under here. Repair kit. Oh, yeah. Okay. Does that mean that we can upgrade our gun? Uh. Oh. Oh. oh, hell yeah. That's that. I'm not sure if there's a time limit. For 10 shells, I would definitely take that. Gunpowder. And there's heaps of stuff you can find. Relying on my peripheral. Oh yeah. What am I finding? I found ammo. I also don't know how long these pills last. Okay. 
get those, so that's good. So let's go and repair that broken gun. And maybe we get an upgrade or something. Highly powerful handgun. It's in bad condition, but it still looks usable. Designed mainly for ease of use. Okay, so this one. Better. Alright. fuel we got some extra hot fuel so we can make some additional stuff we could probably make some, some more of this too all right so let's put all of this away. that away use some of that on us when we need to craft we'll put that away for now and let's carry this one Oh no, we'll do it later. Okay, so I think I'm going to end the episode right here. Because what we got to do in the next episode is we're going to go back into... Uh, wait, hold on, what do we need to do? That's a good question. I'm going to figure that out for the next episode. But we just got the, um, we got the crow key. So... I'm trying to think of other locations on where we need to go with that. So I'm gonna go back to... Hold on, hold on, before we end the episode, I'm, I just wanna make sure, I just wanna check kind of what we need to do. Because I have, I have no idea. We went back into the house with the key. Uh, kids room. So we came through here, the altar, and then that leads us into uh, area where the kid's gonna be contaminated room tension room contaminated room um find the serum ingredients find the arm in the old house open the old house F2 door we have to open that door so I guess we're probably gonna have to go back to the house and find the the mother. So that's what we're going to do in the next episode. We're going to try and find the mother and we're going to steal her lantern, I think is what we need to do. So if you guys have enjoyed this episode, if you had the shit scared out of you and the mother just appeared out of nowhere like I did, uh, let me know down below in the comments. And um, I'd like to know what you guys, ha like if you played this series, what, or not this series, or yeah, this series, but also this game in particular. Um, if you enjoyed it and what you liked about it, even if you didn't enjoy it, I'd actually be curious as to know uh, what aspects of the game you didn't like as well. Um, it's always interesting to hear people's gripes with games, uh, because oftentimes, if people have a reason, the reason's valid. If they don't have a reason, their dislike isn't really valid. They don't know how to validate it. So hearing someone's reason as to why they don't like something often has a lot more merit than uh, you might think. Uh, so I, I, I like to hear that sort of stuff, because it's it's interesting for me, especially as a game developer, uh, to kind of hear uh, what people don't like about a game. Uh, it, it's always it's always interesting to hear that sort of stuff. So any, any kind of opinions you have, leave them down in the comments below. Um, and yeah, there's not much really to say, uh, apart from go and check out my other channel. Uh, the videos are going to be dropping on very soon um for tutorials and my dev log and all that sort of stuff so jump over to that it's also i've been linking at the end of the video as well so if you're still here thank you for watching all the way through 
uh, and definitely check out my other channel. Um, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna come back to I need a mother. I I think that's what we have to do. But we'll, we'll work all that out in the next episode. But uh, until next time, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next episode.